Like we're talking about the new camera that I bought and if I'm a workaholic. I literally couldn't look any dumber if I tried. Oh my God, just to get my bag. So I'm walking to work tomorrow, but Jess is gonna pick me up. The one thing I'm finding with this new setup, the Sony A7C and the Tamron 17 to 28 is, it's kind of bulky, it's kind of heavy to carry around. I still love the fact that I only have one camera, one lens, one mic. It just makes everything so much easier for me. Holy. Did a bit of a workout last night, which was felt super good. I actually feel really good this morning and not doing it after a month, I wanna say like a month. Getting rid of the jingle jangle. I scratched the camera on each side. What are you gonna do? Dude, that's cool. That's it. May I ask your name, sir? Uh, Brad. Devin? You can take the card, sir. Thank you. Just as much. No. Guess it's time to eat. Oh, see, we have full frame, that natural light coming in right now. Look how much smaller they got. Actually, did I roll? Oh, I didn't even roll my pants. Nobody likes when I do this. I love I got battery number two. $140 almost for a battery. Would that make you guys concerned if your new battery came charged at 83%? I wonder, was that refurbished? Like somebody charged it and returned it? <laughs> <laughs> Whose battery comes charged at 83%? The ones I got from Henry were like exhausted. They had nothing left in them. This one's got 83%. I feel like this was returned and repackaged. Let's go see. Come on, let's go see. Did you eat? Wow. One piece of food left. Bro, you cleared that. Well, now that's gone. What's up, guys? Good morning. It's Sunday. Sunday. I'm off. I'm off. I just want to be clear. I am off. But I did go in this morning. Oh! Oh, I wanted to see what the load looked like and I wanted to be able to do a couple things But now I'm home. I wore shorts and if you don't believe me look I wore shorts. I wore shorts and that was the wrong decision People were like looking at me when I was walking to Tim Hortons, but I didn't give a shit I was like I need iced coffee I got To stay fired up And in some other good news, my battery pack that I ordered from Amazon is gonna be here, gonna arrive between 9.45 and 12, so. Oh yeah, eat your buddy. That's the thing with it. Cleaning, Jess has to go to a viewing, unfortunately. Gonna leave her alone today, let her just kinda relax. You like your final? Oh dude, like honestly, I can't even get it on. Yeah, and then the battery. Sanitize. So just to let you guys know, ah, oh, then, pretty much all of my gear and I was gonna upgrade my lens. Or I was gonna keep my Tamron, one of my Tamron lenses, which I had the 11 to 20 for the crop bodies and I had the 17 to 20 for the full frame body. So previously I was using the a7 II and I was using the a6400. Turns out I decided on consolidating that, those two cameras into one, which was what you see the videos being filmed on now, which is the Sony a7C. And I'm very happy with the purchase. Obviously I took a huge hit in terms of value that I got for trading it in because I went back to Henry's. I got $2,000 for a camera body, a very, very old Canon lens, and the Tamron 11 to 20. So I lost a hefty bit of money, but I only came out paying $900 for the a7C and I'm happy. So now I have the one lens, the one camera body, and I'm very, up until this point, I'm very happy. So this is gonna be the camera that I use for the vlog now, because I don't have any other option. I still have my ZV-1, don't, I can't bring myself to like the ZV-1. I really can't, I wish I could, but I genuinely can't bring myself to like the ZV-1. I'm just, and I couldn't tell you why. It's, it's perfect, it's small. There's so many reasons that I stuck with Sony because I was considering going to Canon and just getting an RP and you know getting some RF, getting an RF lens. But the whole goal, regardless of what I did, was to get one camera, one lens, and just stick with that. I get very confused when I have too many of this, too many of that. 
That's why I've slowly given stuff away or offloaded it or sold it for far less than I could have because I just wanted to get rid of it. I just wanted it out of sight, out of mind. Now you guys will be seeing the vlog and if the quality has changed or gotten better, it's because it's on the A7C. So this is always a challenge with the edit. I got about three minutes and 25 seconds and I've cut all the footage that I shot and I'm doing like harsh jump cuts so those frames that I might have extended are a lot shorter. I decided on consolidating that. So I just came from the grocery store and I found the most interesting bags of chips. I saw these and I had to get them. So initially in this vlog, I was gonna talk about some things I've been dealing with, the struggles of work, the stress, how I'm feeling, continue to talk about that, but we need to try these chips. We gotta do like a little taste test. I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion, if they're even worth buying and trying, because I got both bags for six bucks, which is a really good deal. Sit. Pa. Good. Good boy. I know, you gotta try. Other one? Other one? No, other one. Ah, Papa. Other one. <laughs> good. He's not being very cooperative today. I mean, he's being okay. Normally, he's actually really good. He just kind of sits still. He seems to be helping with the drying process. Actually, I'll show you guys. See? He seems to be just giving himself the good old lick. Good. Good. Over the last six weeks, work has been killing me. I've actually gotten to the point where, and I probably said it for months, maybe even longer than that to people that really know me closely. I'm literally like at the point where I'm just ready to call it. You know, you, you tackle the challenge, you overcome it, and then another issue arises and you tackle that. And then, you know, it's gotten to the point where so many issues are happening, you can't tackle them all at once. Trying to get through a day with a positive attitude understanding that that's the goal right there and we got to get there and i've tried to do it with the best attitude that i can but i'm really finding it challenging every day but working on this edit is actually taking my mind off it today so sunday monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday i went in and like i said even if you go in for two hours or you go in for eight hours you're still technically going into work i'm not saying work's not important because obviously work is important and I'm, I've learned this in life and in the latter part of my life, you got to do what makes you happy. I kind of got to go back and not be that person that just finds every reason to go there. Because for as many reasons as I can find to go into work and help, I can find just as many reasons not to go in and work. As I was about to end this vlog, I realized I forgot to try the chips. And she came from Walk and Tyson. I was like, yo, I got cucumber chips. And she's like, gross. I don't like those. She's like, they taste awful. So now I feel like... That when I try them, I'm gonna have that in the back of my mind, like, oh, they're not good. So let's see, uh, let's see how they taste. There they are. We're gonna try both of these. So first ones first, I'm gonna try the tomato. I can't see you guys. I always smell them. Smells interesting. Definitely way more tomato flavor, but these ones aren't bad. If you like the taste of tomatoes and a mild hint of chicken, you'll like these. Third chip. Say this. They're not great though. The moment of truth. It tastes like sour cream and onion. Oh. Oh, okay. They smell like cucumber. All right. I'm gonna take a couple. So we got two chips here. So, definitely cucumber flavor with, it's hard to describe. I will say this, I will not be bringing these chips to any house party or any gathering unless somebody seriously requested it. Uh, if I had to pick, I would definitely go tomato chicken over this one. Uh, but I could definitely see why Jess wouldn't like them because uh, I will not be eating those either. Uh, that is the taste test. This is the winner. This is awful. Edible, but awful. And uh, that's it for the vlog, guys. See you next week.